All right. So, um, like Carolyn said, my name's David Snow. Uh, I'm the APD at UIC. I trained at Cincinnati where I was a chief. Graduated five years ago now. And going to be a PD. I must be crazy. We're going to start that here in a few weeks. Uh, I have the benefit of both mumbling and talking with an accent. So, uh, if you want to get anything from this, then probably come off your phone. Unless you're going to tweet a picture of me, in which case, let me just... Or... Otherwise, just go back to doing what you're doing. Um, so the original title for this was going to be The Problem Resident. Uh, all of these scenarios today are unfortunately things that I've personally been involved in. Um, and as you, you get into these kind of things, you realize that the issues and the challenges that you face aren't necessarily the fault of the residents. So I renamed it The Problem with Residents to be a bit more politically correct. And outlined for the day, there's going to be four cases. Each group, each table is going to review one case. It's going to take about probably five minutes uh, to keep us in time, just to talk about it, things that you, you think should happen. And then we're going to come back in, and I'm definitely going to point fingers and call on people. I'll, I'm not going to do that. But we'll, just, we'll try and make this as interactive as possible. I get that I'm the guy that's going before the break. The coffee was out, and now it's refilled. I know what's going on in your heads right now, but we'll try, we'll try and get something from the group. And then I'll, I'll try and add some insight. You're not going to walk away knowing exactly what to do. As the previous talk mentioned, there's so many factors at play when it comes to handling these situations. But maybe we'll get some tools on how to sort of start acting on these situations. But at the very least, I want to instill some confidence that as chief, you're going to be able to, to start fixing these issues and working with the residents. So... Case one to introduce you, you work on a clinical shift. A PGY2 is not carrying their weight. The off-service resident has more patients than them. These are all things that never happen, right? <laughs> and this is not the first time this has been noticed. All right, case two, work on a clinical shift. A fellow senior resident appears hungover. Ooh, the laughter dissipates. <laughs> a nurse approaches you. A patient has commented on the smell of alcohol on their breath. Case three, you have a rare day off, no admin duties. A fellow resident sends you a screenshot of a co-resident's Facebook page. And it's not good stuff. It's not baby pictures of their children. The image notes protected patient information and disparaging comments about the patient. Case four, another rare day off. Do you actually work at any point, I would ask? <laughs> a fellow resident notifies you that the husband of one of your residents has died. And it's a sudden an unexpected death. Ooh, take the tone down. All right. So now we're going to take just a few minutes. The questions that I want you guys to think about is, what are some immediate next steps? Your chief, this issue is before you. What are some next steps? And what do you feel like is the role of you as the chief? So have at it, people. Got about five minutes. <laughs> 